Hi everybody, Gamer Number 98 here with some more of Let's Play Super Mario 64. Hold on a sec. Okay. Uh, last time we almost finished off Tiny Huge Island. And so, in this episode, we're going to get the, the final star there, which is the 100 coins. Mario must obviously be frustrated if he's kicking the wall. Well, let's just get in the painting. Okay, that took way too long to do. Way too long. So, bye bye, tiny huge island. And hello, um, the next course. You probably saw it um, in a previous episode. Who is. Who is? Never mind. In this room, that's right. That big clock is the next course. But first off, we want to talk to the toad. There's something strange about that clock. As you jump inside, watch the position of the big hand. Oh, look what I found here, Mario Catch! And that's the last toad in the game that will give us a power star. I shall happily take it. I am not looking forward to this. Because this is tick tock clock, a really annoying level. So, yeah, you can see the big hand moving around. So, now the gimmick here is the level actually changes depending on where the big hand is as soon as you jump in. If it's on the three, then time is slow. If it's on six, it time moves randomly. If it's on 9, everything moves quickly, and on 12, time is completely stopped. So all of the stuff like the conveyor belts and the rotate and these rotating platforms 
are affected by time. It is impossible to do a certain style if time is stopped. And that's the fourth one. Why do I hate this level so much? Because it's so easy to fall off. Also, something that should be noted. This is the tallest level aside from Tal Tal Mountain. That was terrible. So the first star is roll into the cage. This is the cage you need to roll into, so I don't know how you roll into it. You can already see another power star down there, can't you? Well, yeah. <laughs> but that's not until a little later. First power star of the TikTok clock. For the, for the second star, I'll show you what it looks like on the six. Okay, just wait. So on the 6, everything moves around at a random pace. Like sometimes they'll slow down, sometimes they'll just suddenly speed up. So yeah, it's quite, quite trippy. Also the conveyor belts will sometimes move in the opposite direction as the arrows. You also gotta watch out because the square rotating platforms will sometimes rotate twice in a row. Like that one on the top just did. Also, if you if you are quite high up on this place and you fall, well, yeah, it's going to be very annoying. You really have to be careful with your control stick because the camera is not very manipulative; can't be manipulated that well here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, I just fell. Well, what else did you expect me to do? Fly for the sky? Of course, I fell. Just gonna be careful about this. We uh oh oh. Maybe I shouldn't have put it on the six because it's messing me about. If you jump off at the top of that pole, you get a one up that homes in on you, and we got another heave hole who can really mess with you. We got this weird triangular platform which I'm hoping will not move out the oh Phew okay pit in the pendulums oh yeah you got the pendulums in the DS remake this place looks slightly different because it's a switch star level oh and there we go Okay, we're off to a good start with TikTok Clock, but watch me call it. Okay. To make this next star easier, you want to wait until the hand's on the 9. So that time will be speeded up. There we go. Okay, this is... Get. A. And. We need to get and here. Yeah, I know. I say I use my hers sounds. What in blazes? Excuse me? Snivy got cursed by a frillish. Hey. That was just a random phone call. So back to the level. So since time, whoa, whoa Nelly, yeah, this this bit can be annoying, especially if you find yourself slowly climbing up. Oh, there's the hand. There's the and we needed. There's the and we needed. <laughs> I gotta get a hand. <laughs> Snivy owns x -ray. I mean, why did you... Of course, the guy who phoned me up would say, what are the odds I would die? And I did! Hey, 
Now I really do need an and. Let's have a carriage ride. Hey, I know I'm British, but not that overly British. Sure, I say things like arse. But, you know, I don't miss out my hers. You want to know what the ironic thing is? Everybody else in my... Pretty much everybody else in my family misses the H sounds when they talk. I mean, I was talking to my brother the other day and he wasn't using any H sounds, so I said, we use, use H sounds, you sound so British. And he just said, thank you. So when we got a hand, we got a star. Simple as that. That's why I said you want to have it so that the clock stops at 9 so that it moves faster and you get the star faster. For this next one, you do not want time to stop. It's best to have it on the free if you're not feeling very confident with your jumps. Stomp on the thromp. This one will require you to climb all the way to the top and believe me, it is quite a climb. So, there we go. It's quite a climb. So this could take a while. Oh! Okay, I slipped off. Why can't it be like the DS remake? Because in the DS remake, there's a lot, there's more footing on the bottom there. There's only one small hole that they could possibly fall through, and that's just after the first conveyor belt. Well, yeah, the main reason that floor's there is because of the extra mission there, with the silver stars falling down from the sky. You have to stop. They have to make it so that it would be next to impossible to them for ever falling off. Which if it did happen, they'll just respawn at the top of the clock and then they'll fall back down again. Wow. Just wow. You really did screw me over this time, Thomas. He's probably laughing at me. Well, I can counter that strategy, dear boy. Hey, gamer number 98. Yeah, I'm talking to me. Die if you hate Trico and Snivy. And they shouldn't be together. Instead, they should be with Trubbish and Grimer. There! Let's see me die now! <gasps> Let's see me die now! Oh, did I just embarrass myself now by saying that? Well, believe me, this guy says some of the oddest things at times. I know I'm not talking much, but... Oh, okay, that scared me. It's just, I need to concentrate a little. Oh. Okay. There's a recovery heart if you ever want it. We've got some more funny platforms. That I can just jump. Oh. Good, I made that. I'm just going to be slow about this. Sure, it will take up more megabytes, but... Slower is safer. Most of the time, anyway. Okay, these things are going to try to push you off. That block over there, you can just jump in here. And it has 10 coins. A nice, easy 10 coins. Well, it might be easy. It all depends. I can't manipulate the camera angle. I have to adjust it to this awkward one. Oh. Uh, I'm, I'm going to fall, aren't I? Nah, I don't think so. Okay, this bit, better to be careful. Awesome. Just let go of the control stick as you land, so therefore you won't slip off. Oh boy, this bit. Okay, just take your time. 
and now you need to get on the hand and just let it take you all the way to where the star is. Here, can't touch this. If we have a look, we can see a thromp. That big blue angry face and the star above him. So we just gotta wait for this hand to carry us over there. No, don't punch. You risk falling off. I tried it before, and so yeah, I regretted it. Come on, come on. Whoa, Nelly! I forgot it went underneath the conveyor belt. Urn! Ha ha! In your face! I didn't. I didn't die. I'm so chuffed now. I don't know why Mario looks like that, but oh well. Twelve more stars in the game. For this one, it's best to have time going slowly, or even stopped. I don't know if stopped will work. Probably will. This is timed jumps on moving bars. This one is... This one is somewhere. Uh, come on, you can explain better than that. I wonder, should I leave my phone conversation in? Well, not all of it, you know, just the real, the, the better parts of it. I'll see. It might cause interference with the microphone anyway, so there might be a buzzing noise. I'll just have to see when I edit this all together. Would be best to backflip. Okay, so... Okay, to be more specific, this star is above the pit and the pendulum star. Is that any better? Okay, that part leads to, like, nothing at all. I don't know why they put that there, but in the DS remake, a star appears there. The silver star star. Okay, so this is the timed jumps on moving bars part. These are the moving bars. You're just going to have to time your jumps so that you can jump on them when they erect themselves. What the hell? And then just jump in here. If in the DS remake, you need Wario for this because there's a black black brick. Black bricks blocking this. And there's our star. Uh, I'm going to have this place done pretty quickly because I'm so hard cut. Okay, for the sixth and final star, which are the red coins, you will want to stop time. So wait for it to get on to 12. 